everyone, it's Margaret Berry here. So this week I was watching a video by Dr. Perry Nicholson, who is known as the Lymph Doc. His Instagram page is Stop Chasing Pain. I was watching one of his videos and he was demoing this technique that I recognized as something that I had seen in Teresa Tapp's T-Tap videos, which she created many years ago. I was noticing that there were similarities and I was like, I want to teach this to people because it's really helpful. This move, you can do it in less than a minute and it actually boosts lymphatic flow, increases circulation, and also can even help you reduce inflammation in your body before, during, or after a workout. The basics of this is that you're rocking back and forth on your heels. This is what Dr. Perry was mentioning on his video because this is like you're, you're rebounding but you're doing it with your own body. Heel to toe, heel to toe, heel to toe. And it's just kind of a little rocking motion. I would say keep your knees out towards the toes so you're not knocking your knees in. But that rocking motion. Okay, Teresa in a lot of her senior fit and fascia fitness videos, she would add what we call a jazz mitten swing to that. So you would take your jazz hands, so space between the fingers as much as possible, and you would swing those hands down, bring them back into a mitten hand. Now a mitten hand is fingers together, pull back the tips of the finger, stretch the thumb. So it would be jazz hand to a mitten hand. Now when you do that, you're gonna feel some pulling down your arm. Part of that is fascia, part of that is lymphatic fluid, and also blood flow. So when you combine the two of those, it would look like this. Jazz hand, mitten, jazz hand, mitten, jazz hand, mitten, back and forward on the toes, back on the heels. You do that in between sets of a workout, you can do it after the workout, but what it will do is help you with that lymphatic exchange, circulation, reducing inflammation, and even improving your mobility over time. Well, I hope that you enjoyed this week's tip. I'd love to hear if you've tried this, or if you've already tried it in one of your T-Tap workouts. Um, there, it's sprinkled in several of them, but it's a really great tool to add into your day, and it's so quick and quite easy, and it feels great. Thanks so much for watching, and I'll see you guys next week.